Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stefano Bernardini and today we will talk about a portable database, SQLite. Let's go! Okay, SQLite is a database engine. It belongs to the family of embedded databases and MuleSoft can embed this portable database in their apps, so in our repository. And then with MuleSoft we can use the database connector. Uh, regarding setup, uh, we just download uh, the SQLite from this site. So we move on, on the browser. We select uh, the right version for our uh, system operating system. Uh, so I pick up uh, the Windows one, SQLite tools. Okay. Uh, then I extract it. Okay. Okay, I move on uh, prompt, okay, then I have to uh, create uh, an SQLite uh, database, uh, for example, with this command, uh, mydb.db, okay, inside uh, I can uh, enter this command in order to create a database. Okay, now the database, uh, my database uh, is uh, here, mydb.db. My okay, let's go back uh, to, the, uh, to the folder. Okay, so this one uh, is my db. So I can place uh, this portable database uh, in, my, in my repository. But first, uh, let's create uh, a, new, uh, a new project in the MuleSoft. Okay, let's create a new project. My sys SQLite, for example. Okay. Uh, let's place uh, our uh, file here. So I just uh, get my folder. I go in the folder, in the resources folder, main resources, and then I, I take the my database and place database here okay now i can also uh, i can also open the behavior in order to uh, to navigate uh, to this uh, uh, to this file to this database okay this is our path okay let's just create uh, a simple table Okay, we just create uh, a simple table. I select uh, SQLite. Okay, uh, my path, I can uh, select the path. Okay, my uh, DB. Okay, and uh, we just ended. Okay. There is no uh, there is no table, so we can create uh, a new table. I don't know, for example, people. Okay, with uh, an ID, a first name, and last name. Okay. Uh, field type uh, text. Okay, perfect. Okay, I save it. Persist. Okay, let's just enter some uh, some data. Uh, Bob red. One more field. Edgar White. Okay. So now I have this this uh, database that is inside my uh, my project. Okay. I can also close this one. Okay. Uh, so now I can create a database configuration. I just uh, pick up from the exchange 
ok data base ok ok i think my folder my dat database is here let's refresh with f5 ok here there is my database ok I can uh, put a, a simple uh, listener with uh, a simple select. Okay. Select and uh, a transfer in order to uh, get uh, the response. Okay. Let's transform in JSON format, payload, okay. Let's configure it. I have to create a new connection. So the driver is, uh, uh, I take the driver from Maven. Uh, the driver is uh, SQLite. Uh, SQLite uh, JDBC, I think. Uh, maybe with the, okay uh, the Excel one uh, it's okay okay the data source reference I have to put a reference uh, to this file uh, and the same reference uh, must be uh, correct also for uh, when I, de I deploy the application so I get uh, I already get uh, the correct version here so I just take the URL from here, uh, JDBC, SQLite, this is the directory uh, where uh, there is a uh, MuleSoft uh, and there is the directory where there is the, my application, okay? It's very important that I place the file only in resources and not uh, in another place, okay? Uh, let's uh, test the connection. Ah, uh, I forgot to select uh, generic, okay, uh, so this is the URL, this is the driver, okay, I don't need uh, the, any password, okay, so let's put uh, a listener, uh, 80, 81, it's okay, uh, SQLite path, for example. I write a simple query, uh, for example, uh, for example, uh, uh, from people uh, select the first name, last name for uh, from uh, people. Okay. Select the first name, last name from people. Okay. And then I uh, uh, map uh, in output. Okay, let's test uh, if everything is okay. Okay, so just uh, I prepare my my invocation, my REST invocation, SQLite. Okay. Okay, we are ready. Let's just uh, invoke. Okay, perfect. Okay, I can also uh, deploy the application. So I select uh, export, finish. Okay, then I move on uh, MuleSoft Anypoint. I select deploy application. My sys SQLite, perfect. I select my file, okay, and then click on deploy. Okay, so this is my uh, load balancer, shared load balancer. I can wait here with my invocation. It says SQLite. 
HTTP. Okay. I'm not uh, ready yet. Okay, we are ready. As you can see, uh, I get the, the, the correct uh, response. It's very important that this database is local only to application. So if you have two workers, every uh, worker have, have his own copy of the uh, of the database. So you don't have to, you don't have to use this database to write uh, stuff. You can only use this database for test purpose or just uh, um, to get uh, to 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 read to read some uh, some records. That's all for now. In this video, you learned how to use uh, SQLite with MuleSoft. Uh, please, uh, if you like my video, smash that subscribe button and see you in the next video. Bye.